Hello, welcome to Brogwell Lane. Uh, this is part two of my Daypole streamlined rail car. Uh, you can see I've uh, done a few things to it over the last week or so. Uh, most notably the roof, uh, now, now grey rather than white. Um, the interior has also been detailed with some figures. There's a driver in the cab and there's a few seated passengers in there as well. Uh, the seats have also been painted. Um, I chose a Brunswick green um, for the seats and with the, uh, pretty much every other point of the interior I matte blacked um, it off a bit um, from, from the tan it came in which I think looks a little bit better. I've also added curtains. Um, this is simply painted on the interior of the glass uh, with a brown paint. I was going to try paper but um, it kept getting stuck in between the uh, body and the chassis when I was trying to put it back together. So I think that looks quite effective. One problem with these um, rail cars is the motor uh, which does encroach into the body, the interior um, moulding. Uh, that's one reason why I thought painting it black would be a better idea and it's pretty well disguised now. There is one window still which uh, is not see-through, which is that one, um, which hopefully isn't too noticeable now. It's been painted black, so it doesn't stand out too much. And highlighted some of the uh, uh, details on the uh, bottom skirt there, like the um, the radiator grills. And so on to give it a bit more depth and highlighted the panel lines as well. Paint on the roof is Rail Match uh, Great Western Wagon Grey, um, and that sort of blends it into the rest of the layout quite nicely. It's a really nice runner. You can see the red tail light there forward the three three headlights there sorry about that it went out of focus a bit I was trying to control the camera and the uh, train at the same time it's an interesting comparison with the Hornby version of the rail car um, although it is a slightly different variation with a more angular front one of the later one the pressed steel version um, this is this was done similarly a few years ago um, uh, it's, it's getting an old model now, but it's it's still it's not terrible. I did have a got flushed laser in it, but it wasn't very successful. But with a bit of subtle weathering and some people inside, it can it can still still look uh, fair enough. So I'll probably keep that as well as a second unit here on Brockwell. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you like. Uh, subscribe. Uh, comment below and I'll see you next time for more modeling fun. Bye bye